And today's read is I Can Write the World. It's by Josanda Sanders, illustrated by Charlie Palmer. We want to see the cover. Beautiful. I Can Write the World. The sun lights the sky over the bronze, bright and orange and yellow. The smell of freshly baked bread in the air from the bakery up the street. The rattle of the fruit stand below, rising from the corner below, honking horns, salsa, and hip hop music. The beeping of a truck that tolls. My bronze is a world of colors and sounds, shapes and sizes that are bright and bold. My name is Ava Murray, and I am eight years old. Chop it up. Mornings with mommy include the news, imagines word, words that I don't always catch, views from outside. I think these are stories about my home, but I don't feel what I see always matches. The girl about my age flashes on the screen. It looks like adults are just being mean. She did something against the rules, painting pretty pictures that make plain walls sparkle like jewels. Oppression. Why is she in trouble, I asked my mom. Because she made something pretty? But she didn't ask permission, mom said. The art is called graffiti, and it is one way kids want to create, share their talents with the world. Creativity is using what you have to make a map of your dreams. What you see in your mind or feel in your heart can come out in bands, colors, or beats. When she was my age, there was no art classes at school, but black and brown kids taught themselves moves, sketch, rap, and made hip hop culture cool. Sometimes the way the world sees us is different how we see ourselves, mom says. She is talking about the news and its views. See, the frame around the window, it shapes everything you see below. Journalists on the news are like the window frame, mom says. They tell stories that they think we should know. Listening to mom talk makes, makes me imagine myself watching the bronze from the sidewalk, talking to neighbors, typing up stories that I find everywhere I walk. 